26-year-old Malawian farmer Deleza Manuel is among farmers west affected by an invasion of four army worms. The mother of three normally harvests over 40 bags of maize from her two-acre garden, but this season she is expecting almost nothing. My entire maize field has been attacked by the army worms and I have nothing now. Army worms are an invasive pest from the Americas that has devastated crops in Africa since 2016. They feed on cereal crops like maize, a staple food in Malawi. Malawi authorities estimate that since November, the worms have destroyed crops for over a quarter million farming families. That means another hunger now. We are going to face hunger in this area. There are a lot of villages which have been affected, as I have said, and it means hunger now. So we need government's, government's intervention. Malawi's Minister of Agriculture blames weather patterns for the army worm invasion. The ministry is distributing free pesticides to affected farmers, but they are getting complaints that they are useless. The problem is that most farmers apply the pesticides when the worms are already grown. As a result, the worms don't die because they're old enough to resist the pesticides. Farmers like Manuel are resorting to homemade remedies to ward off the pests. As farmers, we're using our own traditional methods like applying soil, soup from small fish, leaves from the neem tree and powdered soap. But Malawian farmers say they need more help to recover from the pest's damage. Since government appreciates that the invasion is huge, what we want is that it would consider providing us with seeds, or they should give us food that will take us to the next growing season. Malawi authorities say they will soon distribute seeds to affected farmers. An army worm invasion in 2017 forced Malawi to declare 20 of the country's 28 districts as disaster areas. Lamek Masina for VOA News, Mulanje, Malawi.